now, after you've got pre-approved, you've selected a great buyer's agent, uh, now you're ready to search for your home. Um, you've probably already been looking through um, Zillow or uh, Trulia or Redfin just to find um, a beautiful home that you like. But now you, you have a pretty good grasp on it. You know what price range you want to be in. You know what you want to spend and you know what your max is. So that's good. People ask me, what is the best search engine to find my home? Do I drive around? Are there any tricks? How do I find properties that have not uh, you know, hit the market yet? Uh, well, those are all great questions. Obviously, your home search will probably start online as 92% of people uh, start the home search there. Um, but I will uh, point out to you that every search engine is not the best. And check out my other video on uh, which search engines I love and which search engines I can't stand just for tips and tricks on searching for home. But, but your buyer's agent, they should have their own app. Um, I like to use HomeSpotter and HomeSnap. Those are great apps to find houses and on the market. Uh, but also when, when you're searching for your home, you want to ask your agent, do they have uh, off market homes available? One thing to look out for when you're searching your home and be cognizant of is not to get thrown off by the beautiful photos. It's easy to see a home in the pictures and say, oh my goodness, that is my dream home. But please keep in mind that these homes have been professionally photographed and sometimes professionally staged. And the photographer's and the stager's job is to take your eyes away from the actual home and have you look at the things inside it. But I would say you want to take a step back and actually look at the home and focus on the big ticket items. And I call them Perf Show. P-E-R-F-S-H-O-W. Perf Show is my acronym for the big ticket items in a home. Perf Show stands for Plumbing, electrical, roof, the foundation, the siding, the heating, the outside, and the windows. Why is it so important to concentrate on Perf Show? Because these are the big ticket items. These are the things that um, are the most costly things in a home, and you want to make sure that these things are in good condition when you buy the home so you're not faced with some costly repairs soon after you buy. Buying a home, you will be faced with repairs. That is just a given. So it's a good idea to come up with a um, repair fund to set some money aside after you buy your home so you can have uh, money available for repairs, uh, you know, and be ready for anything. But you wanna really concentrate on the big ticket items so and negotiate for the big ticket items that they're in good condition or at least inspected to know that they have a good amount of life left on them. In your home search, one thing I recommend is making a list, write it down in your phone or on a piece of paper of wants versus needs. You want to really narrow down what are your must-haves in, in your home purchase and what are things that you would like to have. And keep in mind that you may not get everything that you want in the home, but try to get everything that you need and try to be flexible because no home is the same and no home is perfect. The good thing about buying a home, if you're buying an actual house, is that you can make changes because it's yours. So make sure your wants and needs fit into your long-term real estate buying plan. Thank you for watching. Please be sure to check out some of our other videos on real estate topics and please like, comment and share this video and good luck on your property goals.